Hello everybody, it's Eastern Time, we're Lizzie, and welcome back to my channel. We're once again on a Harmony Oasis, episode 2. So, I left off the last episode talking about trying to figure out where I wanted to live. I decided not to go up that place I, saw, I had like found before because I just felt like it was going to be too cramped. So here's like a kind of similar but much more open. I have water in case I want to do like a farm and I can go fishing. And what my plan is currently is to maybe like build a little like house like on the side of the mountain and have like pillars coming down acting like supports and stuff like that. But if I cannot get the support to look right and it looks like bad to me, um, over there, it's like on the other side, I'm actually going to run over to it. Over here has a place where I kind of, I like how it just looks for me to dig into the side of the hill and do that because I haven't like, uh, I can't speak. Sweet life, I kind of lived in the hill, but more or less I did not really live in it. I lived on, on it, but right here, there's kind of like stairs going up and it kind of just goes in. So I think I'd like make a good place to start. I'm actually going to go ahead and cave some. I was trying to find caves and all the ones I was finding were not working. So I don't have very much faith that this is going to turn into a cave, but we're going to try it anyway. I put down a ton of my torches around my bed area because it turned nighttime and I was running home and I got scared. Okay, so let's do that. Torches. Is there anything down here? No, there's not. I want iron so I can make a shield because skeletons hurt. They hurt a lot. Okay, let's check over here. Anything? Die, please die. Nope, okay. Whoop de do! What a lovely cave! Aren't we proud of my cave hunting abilities? I killed a spider. I collect like eight pieces of coal. I'm on top of the world, man. I don't need anything else. Psych. Okay. So I know I saw. It's a cave. If this cave does not give me anything good, I am going to start a farm. Okay, um, there's a skeleton. Um, is there another way to go? No. How many is that? Is that two or three? Oh no, they see me. I want to kill them. That would be the most favorable outcome. There's iron. I can get a shield if I get that iron. I need to eat something before that other skeleton shows up. I just want the iron, please. Oh, there's a third one. I just want to quietly and quickly get this iron. Is it coming towards me? Okay, that's where it's at. Okay, so at least this one had iron. That's an improvement from the last, can I even call it a cave, that I found. But yeah, this area just does not want to give me a suitable cave, so I'll have to, at some point, make a strip mine down, which I do anyway. It's just, I prefer to actually, like, cave first. 
So I have like an iron pickaxe to quickly make the staircase down to diamond level because that takes forever. I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, it was only four. I thought it was more than four. I need to get more cobblestone so I can make a furnace. And I'm going to make a shield. Okay, um, furnace there. Oh my god, my mouth is literally, like, making me so angry. I went that way to find a cave, and it was just, I almost died, like, right away. I saw a cave, I walked in, and there's, like, three skeletons and a zombie standing there, and I was like, okay, and I was gonna, like, one and a half hearts when I ran away. I want to make a shield. Top priority. Bam. And bam. And now I can't die. Okay. I still need armor and everything, of course. But at least now I'm not going to get like three shot by a skeleton. Up there is like a one layer floating island type thing. I don't know if I'm going to keep it or not. I can't really see it from here as so it doesn't bother me too much. But who knows what else I'll do in the area. Um, for Do I have enough stuff to start a wheat farm? I have one singular piece of wheat. Or wheat seeds. I mean, I have a lot of bones right now. I can always just kind of grow it and do it that way. I need more uh, cobblestone. Once I do my strip mine, at least I'll have more cobblestone. I won't have to do this. Just a mine out the side of my oh my god, mine out the side of my mountain. I could use the three iron that's left over to make a bucket, but I am not going to do that for the reason being I want to get armor as soon as possible. So I want to, I want to have a wheat farm and a uh, sugarcane farm. I'm going to make a shovel too, I guess. Perfect, okay. Shovel, okay. Let's mine this out a little bit. So when I place down sugarcane over here, it's going to grow. And this also gives me a couple blocks just to use when I need to use them. I don't have much. Like, I like starting off in survivor world, but when you can't find a cave right off the bat, it makes it difficult. Because like in the caves where I get um, blocks like cobblestone to just kind of like mess around with when I need to pillar up somewhere and stuff. I can't do that if I don't find a cave. Okay. Let's put these down. And make sure it's lit up. And then start the wheat farm. I'm going to turn all of this into bell meal. And just going to... Keep growing it until I have a lot of seeds. Because my pumpkin pie is actually going by like really quickly. So I'm gonna have to like switch over to bread soon. I don't wanna kill any mobs by me. Oh, I can also start like, just like an animal farm since I have wheat now. I'll have to hold off and getting pigs. I can't find any carrots. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and see three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. And then I'm only going to plant down fourteen. That way I have two more in case I want to get chickens. I'm going to plant that. Okay. So, let's make some fencing for my uh, 
like sheep and cows that aren't here yet. Um, oh my god, I cannot build at all. Oh, okay. Ignore my dumbness. I'm only slightly tired, slightly. I, okay, oh my god, slight rant. So I have a speech class and I had a speech prepared and I thought our presentations were on like the Thursday, like, so right now it's a Monday and I thought it was the Thursday last week because when she assigned it, she said it was going to be Friday and the other class was presenting Thursday because I have orange and blue days and they alternate and so she said Friday, but our class was on Thursday. I mean, it's common sense to think she just kind of got them flipped around because like I said, she said the other class was going to be Thursday. So like she just has them flipped. That means ours is Thursday. Theirs is Friday because that's the only way it can do it because I can't do theirs on Thursday and we can't do ours on Friday. So I was really prepared to look like an hour rehearsing because I am shy and I don't like speaking in front of the class. Only to then find out when I joined into the Google Meet that, oh, I'm moving it to Monday for the confusion about the dates. I'm like, it's not that confusing. I know I'm the only one who like thought it was that day because only like two people showed up to the Google Meet and only two people showed up because the other ones didn't want to come because there was a presentation. So I was kind of annoyed. And then, so today was when I was supposed to do the presentation now, so I'm just going to do it Thursday. Took an hour before class to, like, prepare myself, hype myself up to talk in front of the class, and just getting it overall prepared. We ran out of time before we got to me. So now, it's like, sure, more practice, but I'm not going to practice. I'm going to practice again an hour before class starts, so that means three hours going towards the speech. But the previous two hours are worth nothing because I don't remember anything. Goldfish memory. So it's like, there is a slight bit of salt. For now, am I just going to put the animals in one pin? Let's put the stuff. I need to sleep real quick. That way I don't get attacked by monsters and I can go look for animals. There's a zombie approaching me. Um, I got two gates. Please go away. I am trying to peacefully be a farmer and you're disrupting that peace. Okay. Now let's go find some very nice animals. If they're not so nice, they can get... Smacked with a stick, I guess. Okay, there's chickens and there's sheep. Oh my god, my throat hurts. Oh, dog! Hold on. Okay, sorry, dog was being really loud and then I kind of like forgot to do it, say anything because I was concentrated on getting the chickens in the pen. Okay. 
Let's get the sheepy boy through the gate. So I think that is a good start to an animal pin. Sorry. I think it's like common knowledge now, second episode of my SMP series aren't ever very interesting. They're always mining or exploring. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed. We now have, this is new, I normally don't do animal farms this soon. But we now have a wheat farm, a sugarcane farm, and some animals. Got three chickens. I thought I only had two, but okay. And one sheep. I was hoping to get cows, but it's fine. They were right there. And I'm trying to do shorter videos just because it seems like you guys like them better than the longer ones, which makes sense. Who wants to listen to me for 30 minutes straight? I don't. <laughs> I don't even like um, preview them or like rewatch them to check for errors when they're that long. I'm like, uh, I trust myself at editing at four in the morning. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I think I mentioned this last episode, but upload schedule plan at least is Crystal Craft Tuesdays, uh, Harmony Oasis Thursdays. So that's the plan. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye!